What up YouTube, Sahih here. Today I'll be showing you as how to update your latest iOS 7 version to iOS 7.1 beta version that has been recently released by Apple. Well, I'll be providing the link in the description of the website that you need to go and download your IPSW of your respectable devices, the beta version. So after downloading the IPSW, as you can see, I have placed my iPhone 5S 7.1 beta onto your desktop for easy access of selecting the IPSW. After doing this, after downloading the file, you have to connect uh, your phone to iTunes and after connecting your phone to iTunes what you need to do is you have to hold down the shift key onto your keyboard and just click on check for updates after clicking check for updates a window pop-up will appear and you have to select your IPSW and click on open after clicking on open you will be getting a message prompt as to update to iOS 7.1 or cancel uh, as I have already updated my iOS 7.0.4 to iOS 7.1 so I'll be just clicking on cancel and as you can see here this is a very simple and easy free process to update your ios uh, latest ios firmware to ios 7.1 beta so what's new in ios 7.1 as i have noticed three main features that has been introduced in ios 7.1 the first one is related with the settings when you go into your settings accessibility and when you just uh, switch on the toggle of the bold test text or switch off your phone won't be reporting itself uh, as it's it, it's really convenient and also a, a darker keyboard has been introduced when you just toggle on the use darker keyboard uh, when you go into your notes application as you can see the keyboard has been darkened the white keyboard has been removed and the keyboard has been darkened and this can be used in each application for instance like uh, i'll be just going into my mail application and as you can see here the darker keyboard has also been switched on on my uh, mail application the second thing that I have noticed is the notification center when you just swipe the notification down you'll be seeing a text as no new notification previously before uh, nothing was there no text was there so it's it's also a nice convenient way to uh, see whether you have notifications on or not. The third one that I have seen is the camera. When you go into a camera application as to, uh, towards the top of the status bar, you can see that HDR auto on or off is indicated. And when you keep your HDR on or auto, a yellow color indication will be appearing. And if you switch off the toggle, a white color will be appearing. So these were the changes that have taken place in iOS 7.1 and also I have found some the, uh, some of the transitions has been a lot smoother and uh, to my extent the battery life has been uh, like 5 to 10 percent increased uh, as per my usage. So if you guys like my video, find my video, so please do comment, subscribe, hit the like button and do follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, till then, I'll be seeing you in my next video.